Hi, and welcome to Cool Gadgets and Stuff. Choosing a construction system is one of the key decisions you'll have to make when building a new home. Building technologies continuously improve, and in this video we're going to explore some interesting building systems that might offer some advantages compared to conventional construction. This is our fourth video on building systems, so be sure to check out our home building playlist. Hempcrete is a biocomposite construction and insulation material. It's made by mixing the inner woody core of the hemp plant with a lime binder to create a light concrete that retains thermal mass and is highly insulating. Hempcrete is a non-structural material, meaning it doesn't have the compressive strength of a residential grade concrete and has to be cast around a timber, steel, or concrete frame. Hempcrete walls are fireproof, regulate moisture, and also resist mold and pests due to the alkalinity of the limestone. It is very suited to areas at risk of seismic activity since it is a low density material that is resistant to cracking under movement. The material is eco-friendly and carbon negative. This is due to the amount of carbon dioxide stored during the growing and harvesting of the hemp. Hempitecture from Idaho specializes in hemp construction services and hemp wool insulation products. They also work with architects and builders to develop energy efficient, non-toxic, and eco-sustainable habitats. There are three primary ways of building with hempcrete. First is the cast-in-place technique. Here, hempcrete is mixed on-site and packed in between form boards to create walls. This is the most traditional approach to hempcrete, however, it can be labor-intensive. Second is the spray-applied technique, which is significantly faster. This technique requires a substructure for hempcrete to be sprayed around, usually a geotextile mesh. A third way is a pre-cured hempcrete block that offers a fast and simple solution. No on-site mixing is required. Just stack them along the load-bearing structure, whether it's frame or beams, or use them as an insulated formwork for load-bearing masonry. When the hempcrete wall is finished, an exterior plaster is applied to provide necessary protection from the rain. Isohemp, a Belgian company, is offering a number of hempcrete products such as different size blocks and related services like engineering and training courses. Hempitecture is a distributor of isohemp products. The newly legalized status of industrial hemp as an agricultural commodity by the 2018 U.S. Farm Bill means the future of hemp as a building material looks very promising. System 3E, developed in Poland, is a dry stack wall construction system based on blocks made of natural perlite, a volcanic mineral with special properties. 3E blocks have a characteristic self-anchoring shape, thanks to which it's possible to construct walls without binder or mortar in a simple and fast way. The 3E blocks consist of a proprietary mix of natural perlite and mineral binders, designed so that the blocks make maximum use of the unique properties of perlite, like resistance to high temperatures, chemical inertness, thermal insulation, sound absorption, moisture resistance, resistance to pests and mold, and vapor permeability. Because of the unique shape and precise workmanship, 3E elements combine perfectly and in combination with a reinforcing layer of fiberglass mesh, plus external and internal plaster offer structurally sound walls without any thermal bridges, which is a major source of heat loss for many buildings. 3E systems are suitable for two-story housing projects as well as industrial halls and outbuildings. Holes and installation grooves can be drilled without damaging the durability or strength of the blocks. 3E walls are free from chemicals, plastics, and mortar, and are friendly to human health and the environment. Solid log construction refers to structures built with full logs, stacked horizontally and interlocking at corners by notching. Alternatively, half logs can be used for siding on conventional framed walls, giving the appearance of a log building. A log cabin traditionally refers to a smaller, more rustic log house, such as a hunting cabin in the woods. But today's modern log construction 
offers innovative designs that create a comfortable yet upscale feel. They can feature tall ceilings for an open, airy feel, as well as grand stone fireplaces and modern kitchens. A perfect combination of luxury and cozy comfort. Golden Eagle Logs and Timber Homes from Wisconsin Rapids designs and builds premium log homes that are pre-built and shipped as kits and assembled on site. You can choose from many log sizes, shapes, textures, and corner styles. With the walls and roof support structure complete, gone are the successive steps of insulating frame walls and applying finish materials both inside and out. They are also designed with conventional interior partition walls, giving you the option of using drywall, stone, or tongue and groove to complement your home. Log walls are pre-drilled for electrical wiring and cut out for electrical boxes. For log homes, it's recommended at least two feet of distance between the ground and the first course of logs to help protect the wood from water. Rock and other cladding can also be used on the lower portion of the home to act as a barrier. Logs are kiln dried to remove moisture, so to minimize the shrinking of the logs diameter once put in place. Kiln drying also sanitizes the logs, killing all microorganisms, mold, bacteria, and insect larvae. As logs and timbers dry, the shrinkage causes small cracks, known as checks, to slowly open over time. This is natural and occurs in all log houses regardless of the construction or drying method. When construction is done, log homes are stained to preserve the wood. Routine maintenance is also essential. Inspecting logs for large cracks that catch water will help avoid costly repairs. Log homes are great at maintaining temperature and conserving energy. This is due to the massiveness of the logs and their ability to absorb heat during the day and radiate it at night. A log cabin also breathes or regulates moisture naturally through the timber walls so you won't get the feeling that the air is too dry or too moist. All this helps keep the home comfortable, without having to rely much on heating or air conditioning systems. Log homes are typically built in rural settings. This rustic, architectural style naturally blends with the surrounding landscape, giving you a sense of connection with nature. SIPs, or structural insulated panels, are building panels comprised of rigid foam insulation sandwiched between two structural layers of wood or metal. In this segment, we'll take a closer look at steel SIP systems. Steel face SIPs are manufactured under factory controlled conditions and are custom designed for any structure. They are used in floors, walls, and roofs for residential and commercial buildings. Using special bonding technology, Light gauge steel structural elements are bonded together with polystyrene foam, delivering a strong light wall system that installs faster and provides structural framing, insulation, sheathing, and vapor barrier all in one step. Steel SIPs have tremendous strength to weight ratio, making them light and easy to install without heavy equipment like cranes. They are also mold, pest, and rot resistant. There are several types of steel SIPs on the market. Thermosteel is a panelized building system that is capable of providing a non-combustible, load-bearing building envelope. It provides exterior and interior walls, as well as floors and roofs. The panels are simply set into a base track and capped with a top track channel. No fasteners are required for the tongue and groove vertical joints and have a tight foam-to-foam -foam contact. The top metal channel acts as a moisture and vapor barrier and integrates the entire wall and roof system together, giving it more strength. Another company, Structal's Snap and Lock Insulated Panels, are comprised of metal skins that are rolled to form a unique locking system that easily snaps together and an energy-efficient continuous polystyrene foam core. The internal locking system eliminates the need for additional fastening methods at the joint. A sealant is encased in the joint forming a waterproof seal. Steel SIP homes cost similarly to conventional ones. While material costs may be higher than a typical framing package, it is offset by savings due to speed of construction, reduced waste, 
and energy efficiency. The complete structure is very strong and yet still lightweight. The panels allow for attachment of any exterior or interior finish you wish to apply. EcoCocon, a European company, has developed a unique straw building system. Their compressed straw panel elements provide an economic, healthy, and ecological solution for the construction industry. Straw is a natural and easy to obtain material. It's also an excellent insulator and it's vapor permeable, ensuring healthy air inside the house. Panels are engineered with a structural double wooden frame so they can support floors and roofs. The foundations are the same as for a conventional house. Assembling the straw panels on site is fast and precise. Only simple tools and standard screws are needed. A team of three people can assemble around 100 square meters or 1,000 square feet of wall per day. The EcoCocon straw panels provide a load-bearing construction element and, at the same time, the main insulation of the building. Clay plaster can be applied directly on the inner straw surface and lime or fiberboard and cladding to the outer. Panels have a dense and strong structure, allowing for all furniture, electronic devices, pictures, etc. to be mounted on the walls using ordinary wood screws. EcoCocon panels can be used for building homes with one or more stories. All building regulation requirements for resistance, compression, durability, and fire protection. With custom-made dimensions and layouts, these panels can fit any building design and provide architects with creative freedom. Thanks for watching, and let us know your opinion down in the comments. Stay tuned, until next time.